Hello everyone, today we are going to write a program to find the area of triangle and the area of rectangle. So before going on to the program, we must know the formula of these two things. So here the formula of area of triangle is 1 by 2 base into height and the formula of rectangle is L into B. So you have to know this formula. So first let's solve about area of triangle. So in area of triangle, we have the formula 1 by 2 into base into height. So here are the two variables that is base into height. So the first step is we need to ask the user to input the base and height. So for that, so for that the first step is so we always write CLS which is to clear the screen and the first step that so the first step that we do is we ask the user to input the base into base and height because the area of triangle is 1 by 2 into base into height where base and height are the variable so we don't know the value of base and height so in this case we ask the user to input the base so for that we write input enter the base and then we'll give a, a semicolon and here we if the user enter the base then uh, it should be stored somewhere on a computer if the user enter the value 10 then it will be stored on the variable b similarly we again ask the user to input the height so for that we write input enter the height so for this also we need to specify some location on a computer if uh, a user enters some value it must be placed somewhere on a computer so it uh, so here we'll again uh, specify another variable which is as so the third step is we need to write the formula so here we are calculating a, a area of triangle so aot is an area of triangle so area of triangle is equals to 1 by 2 into base into height so uh, our last step is we can just print and then we can just simply in the program so we have already find the area of triangle so to find the area of rectangle area of rectangle we know that we know that the formula of area of rectangle is length into breadth so here in this case we need to ask the user to input the length and breadth but we have already asked the user to input the breadth so it's not necessary to ask the user again so now we need to ask the user to input the length so here in this case we'll uh, ask the user to input the length so here we'll solve the both program for the length if the user enters some value on a computer it should be stored on somewhere on a com computer memory so here we are declaring a variable that is l so now uh, we'll write a formula to calculate the area of rectangle so for that we'll write at area of triangle is equals to l into b so our next step is we need to print the we need to print the formula of the rectangle so the area of rectangle is area of rectangle is a because our formula is stored on a variable at so here we are printing at for the area of rectangle the formula of our area of triangle is stored on AOT. So here we are printing the value which is stored on AOT variable. So now let's run the program. To run the program you can go to the run and click on start. Or you can press F5. So here you can see it asks to enter the length. So I am entering 2 well as a length and base as a 2 and height as a 6. So here, so here you can see that the area of triangle is 6 and the area of rectangle is 24. So this is how you can solve a program. You, have, you can write a program to find the area of triangle and the area of rectangle in the QVC.